at this first location we're diving in about six to ten meters of water so we take nice slow movements getting down to the bottom and coming back up to save any barotrauma which is also known as mebt here in tasmania we're not allowed to use any utensils to help us catch these crayfish either it all has to be by hand you don't get the grab every single time here's one that is missed sometimes when you have the excitement of seeing a crayfish there underwater um, you completely forget about the technique that you normally employ. Here is a pretty successful grab and a fantastic example of a crayfish just wedging itself in between a couple of rocks. Sometimes this happens and you really need to be persistent to just really pull that sucker out of there because it will do everything that it can to not leave that hole. <laughs> Managed to find one big male. Unfortunately, there were some other big bulls in there, but I just couldn't quite get a grip on them. 